Hello folks, Jeremy C. Parsons here with another edition of the Parsons Perspective. Uh, it's about 1.30 in the morning on Sunday, October the 29th, 2017. Uh, let me start off by saying big win for the Notre Dame Fighting Irish on Saturday night over the over NC State. Uh, Notre Dame won, uh, TCU lost, Penn State lost, and uh, Miami barely beat an unranked team. So I fully expect the Notre Dame Fighting Irish to at least be sixth as we go into the rankings. And uh, playoff possibilities are now looking very, very favorable. Look out for the Irish. My main focus of topic tonight, though, is people that use the Internet, use um, social media for the sake of just bitching and moaning. I mean, come on, people. You know, it's... Are you really that miserable in life that you have to make others miserable? That you have to give out your your bad vibes? Your, you know, I, I just don't get it. You know, I posted a concert review from an Eagles show that I saw Tuesday night in Louisville, Kentucky. And uh, it's, it's gotten like um, about 550 views last I saw. It was shared by an, another person on a Eagles message board. And uh, which I noticed a lot of pe- those people on that message board can, tend to be a little snarky. And, you know, which that is what it is. I don't post on there too much. But, you know, I posted my review. And someone insulted me. They call me fat. They call me a redneck, redneck face, whatever the hell that is. And uh, said, I, I don't know anything about music. You know, I, I never claim to be a music theory major by any means. I am someone that purchases music, though. And I know what I like. I go to concerts. This is like my 17th concert this year, I believe. And uh, I've got two more scheduled next weekend. And, you know, I'm just, I'm, I'm a fan of music. I'm a fan of live music. The, the Eagles are my favorite band of all time. Uh, you know, uh, closely followed, I guess, by Bob Seger and the Silver Bullet Band. But uh, there's no need to insult me. I know what I like. Everyone's entitled to their opinion. You don't have to agree with it. If uh, you want to leave a little comment on one of these videos and tell me why you disagree with something... You are more than welcome. I encourage it. I welcome it. Um, but if you, do not swear at me and do not personally attack me because that's just absurd. And there's no excuse for it. Uh, you know, people use the internet and social media as a way to bully people or attack people and it's disgusting. People use the internet as a way to whine and cry and piss and moan. And, uh, <laughs> you know, I, I'm a fan of the... Uh, Saturday Night Live Facebook page, and just tonight even, the number of comments that I'm reading from from people that weekly bitch about the show. Tonight they were airing a 30-minute animated special about David S. Pumpkins, you know, from a goofy Tom Hanks skit that they did about a year ago, and, uh, and people are just crying and complaining about it, and, and uh, you know, saying that they'll never watch SNL again, and and so don't watch it. It's the same people that cry and complain all the time. And, you know, people were shocked that they were airing this cartoon, this animated special that they've been promoting the hell out of for the past week. And, you know, and then people act like they didn't know how long it was going to be or they thought the whole thing was going to be animated. It's 2017. Do you people not have a guide on your television? Do you not have Internet access? I mean, come on. It's... You know, the thing was 30 minutes long, followed by a 60-minute SNL Halloween special. There's no need to just piss and moan about everything. Enjoy life once in a while. Was it, was it fantastic? And I watched it. No, it wasn't that good. It had, it had its moments. It was a goofy little thing. But you know what? I don't think uh, it's the great pumpkin Charlie Brown is that fantastic either. And I, I've been watching that since I was, you know, knee-high. Uh... The point is, you know, social media doesn't have to be negative. I don't think it started out that way. And yet we have, we as society have turned it into that way. And I, I've deleted friends and I've 
block people, unfollow people because you just get tired of reading negative stuff all the time. I mean, my God, let it go. You know, learn to be happy once in a while. If you're so miserable, maybe part of it is, is you know, you've got your phone in your face all the time and, and uh, you know, you're constantly looking on Facebook or, or doing whatever and maybe that's, that's part of it, you know, because we don't actually interact with real people anymore. But, you know, just, you know, you don't need to insult people all the time. And it's it's just goofy. I, you know, I saw someone was, someone said, oh, I thought it was hilarious. And someone else responded with, well, I see now why you're single. I mean, come on. That's not necessary now, is it? I don't think so. Be kind to one another, you know? Yeah, I've, that, that's something that, and again, I'm, I'm guilty of it too at times. But uh, overall, you know, just you get tired of reading that stuff. Be nice to each other. Be kind. And that I'll get off my soapbox. That's all I got to say. Have a blessed evening if you watch this or enjoy the rest of your weekend. Have a great week. I'm sure I'll post another thing up on YouTube at some point next week. Until then, have a good night, folks. Take care. Be kind to one another. And be nice on social media. You never know who's watching.